Allah. Okay, Sheikh, my question is uh, regarding shortening the prayer while we are traveling and also combining them. We all know that we uh, have the option of combining the Zuhur and Asar prayer and Maghrib and Isha prayer while traveling and also we, we can shorten it. Uh, but the dispute among the scholars arise when we reach a particular place. Some say uh, you can shorten your prayers up to four days, some say you can do it 15 days. Uh, Zuhayb, you said in one of Zuhayb, are you talking about reaching your hometown or reaching your destination you're traveling to? No, no. I traveled from my home country to another country. To another country. So you're allowed to shorten and combine your prayers. Even if you reach that town, for example, if you are residing in Lahore and you're traveling to Islamabad, you go to Islamabad for five, six days, seven days, ten days, you combine and shorten there because you are still labeled as a traveler. When do you pray normally? When you become settled, meaning that you have an apartment or you have moved in with your brother or with your cousin and now you're settled, you're staying there for three, four months. This is when you start to complete your prayer and Allah knows best.